Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we uncover the shocking truth about Oumuamua, the mysterious interstellar visitor that scientists now believe is not a comet, but a frozen fragment of an ancient exopluto flung across the galaxy. One Eye Oumuamua the first interstellar object to visit our solar system in 2017 belongs to a completely new class of space objects, scientists have discovered. It is a piece of an icy exoplanet, more specifically an exopluto, a group of cosmic bodies that are highly unlikely to visit the Sun. Everything about this object is consistent with it being a slab of nitrogen ice, like you see on the surface of Pluto, said Steve Desch an exoplanet researcher at Arizona State University. It wasn't spotted until 40 days after it had made its closest approach to the Sun. Canadian Robert Werrick spotted it using the Pan-STARRS telescope at Haleakala Observatory, Hawaii, on 19th of October 2017. Its strange, elongated shape caught the attention of space enthusiasts who were awestruck to see the weird space rock floating through our star system. Objects that originate in the solar system are a mix of water ice, rock, and carbon-rich material, remnants from the time the solar system was born. But this was not the case with Oumuamua, leading scientists to determine that it was an interstellar object. NASA's New Horizons spacecraft determined during its 2015 flyby of the Kuiper Belt and Pluto that it is made of nitrogen ice. It was also observed to consist of similar nitrogen ice. Desch said at the progress in understanding the Pluto mission, 10 years after flyby conference in Laurel, Maryland, that the interstellar object might be the skin of an exopluto. Initially, astronomers classified it as a comet that was traveling from another star system. However, recent findings suggest that it might not be a comet at all. Oumuamua appears to be almost pure nitrogen ice, which places it in a different category of objects. Besides, its elongated shape is extremely different from 2i Borisov and 3i Atlas, the other two interstellar comets. Our solar system was a chaotic place for millions of years right after it was born. Desch says the giant planets released a lot of material, ejecting most of the icy stuff. Most of these bodies reside in the Kuiper Belt today. He adds that at one point, there was probably so much of this stuff that 2,000 Plutos could have been born from them. However, collisions led to the scraping of nitrogen from the outermost layer of these Plutos. Oumuamua seems to be one such piece of a Pluto that once existed in the Kuiper Belt. Desh and Jackson believe that Oumuamua's properties show that it is more likely a fragment of a Pluto-like object than a comet. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.